As crews removed the wreckage of a crash plane from a northern Florida neighborhood. It's not every day you get to see a helicopter pick a airplane up in your front yard. New details are emerging about the man who was at the controls. Court papers outlining the federal charges against 38-year-old Marcus Schrenker say investigators who searched the empty cockpit found a road atlas with the Alabama and Florida pages removed. They also found a campground directory with the same two states' listings torn out. Schrenker was arrested late Tuesday at a remote Florida campground. U.S. Marshals found him semi-conscious inside a tent. Schrenker was recovering Thursday in a heavily guarded hospital room after an apparent suicide attempt. He's expected to appear in court in Florida before returning to his home in Indiana. Schrenker's arrest kept a dramatic two-day run from personal and financial ruin. Schrenker was flying a single-engine Piper Malibu to Florida from his Indiana home when he reported the windshield had imploded over central Alabama. Military jets tried to intercept the plane and found the door open, the cockpit dark. The aircraft crashed more than 200 miles farther south. Police believe he parachuted to the ground, then reclaimed the motorcycle he'd stashed in a storage unit and sped away. Uh, it's certainly something right out of Hollywood, uh, someone parachuting out of a plane to avoid capture as a fugitive uh, is certainly not the run-of-the-mill case for us. The new criminal charges include intentionally wrecking the aircraft and faking a distress call. Schrenker was previously charged with acting as a financial manager even though his license had expired in Indiana. State regulators have also filed complaints against him that he unfairly charged seven investors $250,000 in fees he didn't tell them about. According to an Associated Press review when Schrenker took off from Indiana, he already faced $9 million or more in potential and actual court judgments and legal claims. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.